Hey guys, welcome to another satisfying video. This one is not our cuts, but this is actually a garden bed refreshing what we call. You got an existing garden bed or garden beds that you need uh, service that have been, you know, lack of attention or just haven't had the time to get out. We come in and refresh it and make it brand new. So there you go, see, pulling those weeds, putting new soil, now, the important part like this, having the landscape fabric down to uh, to help make sure that there's minimal weeds coming back. And then you'll see later that we plant like right in through the mat um, into the soil underneath and then mulch over top of that. And that's just going to help it basically give the weeds no options to uh, come through and have your garden bed looking fresh for as long as possible. Here we are planting takes a long time, meticulous work to measure where the plants are and make everything symmetrical as much as possible. That's the time we take to do this type of stuff. Yeah. Look at them go. Getting those trees, last one. Beautiful. Beautiful. And then comes the mulching. The mulch, the dyed black cedar mulch. Adds a nice pop to the green grass and all the plants around. This job was quite intensive. Labor intensive, I should say. Because it's kind of a bigger property, so just bringing everything. There's the final, final product. Here's the front that we also did. For some reason, the quality of this video is just is much lower than the other one. I don't know why. I'll have to look into that. But these are all, I believe they're Alberta, thi Alberta thistles, and they're just so spiky and thorny. They were terrible to deal with. I think that's why the video's terrible, because the, the weeding is terrible. But we did. Got it done, as we always do. Pull them out. And the finished pro finishing product should be coming up shortly. There it is. Looks much better. And then they had one more garden along the side in the back as well. These ones are not bad. The weeds were pretty easy to pull. And if you can believe it, there's a bunch of roses behind there. That are really nice. But we just kept going and going. This type of work you get with us, we we put everything into our work, you know, we there's no shortcuts, there's nothing, we just we do everything proper. Do it the right way so that you guys can get the best result. And feel like you had, you know, you got your money's worth. We are not the cheapest, but we do our best to make sure that everything is looking mint. And here you go. Finishing mulch again. We also did the power washing and sanding of the interlock you see behind you. Or behind uh, me there. But, uh, we couldn't film multiple things at the same time. Maybe you'll have to invest in another camera. And stand. But that's only if we get lots of views and new followers. So guys, please. Like and subscribe to our channel. It means a lot when you guys do that. There's the finished product. And this one was uh, river rocks that were just weeds everywhere. So we rip up, take the rocks out, get the weeds out, put a fabric down, do it the right way so you... You have long last longevity to your landscape. Not just the quick fix, you know. So, there is the fabric going down. Here goes the rocks. Thanks for watching.